How's it going, everybody? Buzzer Mobile here, bringing another absolute banger of a platinum. Today, we've got another one from East Asia Soft called Moe Waifu Echi Block Blast. Shout out to them for getting me a code for the game. And you're looking at five bucks cross buy on the PlayStation Store with only two stacks, one worldwide PS4 and PS5 stack each. This is an arcadey block breaking game where you're trying to bounce a ball up into blocks. The ball will bounce back off the blocks and you have to keep it going by using your paddle thingy at the bottom of the screen to direct the ball to where you want it to go. There's a number of power-ups that can drop when you break a brick, increase or decrease the size of your paddle, add rockets to either end of your paddle, which can destroy bricks in two hits, speed up the ball, make the ball a fireball that breaks straight through every block in the game without bouncing off, a wall at the bottom of the screen so your ball can't be lost, the ability to add another ball into the field of play, extra lives, and extra time. Trophy-wise, you've only got one goal here, and that's to finish all 15 levels in the game. There's five waifus you'll have to get through, all of which have three separate levels with three separate outfits, two-thirds of which I can't show on YouTube as they're a bit too scandalous for the content plot. The fireball power-up is by far the best one in the game, especially in the later levels where they add blocks that your ball normally can't destroy, but the fireball can. Try your best to avoid the size decrease power-up as it definitely makes the game harder, but aside from that, I would go for every power-up in the game. The timer is pretty generous to begin with, but you can get super unlucky in some of the later levels with more of the metal bricks, so the power-ups will absolutely save your life on those. Going in completely blind, this took me right around 50 minutes to finish, and I would probably expect you to take around that long as well. I think anywhere in the 30 minute to slightly over an hour range is a pretty good time for this Platinum. This is a game that's definitely going to have the time to Platinum determined by how good you are at these types of games, but more importantly, by your luck in getting the better power-ups to spawn. All right, that'll do it for me though, everybody. Super simple, easy, cheap, fast Platinum today. If you enjoyed today's video, be sure to leave a like, comment down below which number platinum this was for you, and subscribe to the channel for more trophy hunting content. This was number 1063 for me.